What's up, y'all? I just got off of work like less than an hour ago. Just got an oil change. Uh, I need to get some toothpaste from the store. I'm kind of mad as hell right now because they, that Rite Aid that used to be up by my spot over here, they just recently closed all the Rite Aids in Michigan. Like, bro, I used to be able to walk up to there and get what I needed. Now I got to go down the street. But while I'm down there, I'm about to pick up some Indian food. I've never had no Indian food before. Uh, I'm about to try out this chicken chicken dumb biryani and then i got like a cheat like a butter nan or something i'm about to go see what it's hitting for uh so yeah let's go got the fender on you know what i'm saying matching the you know you gotta throw the jinkos on everything so should i do i throw on the classics or the tazes for this one i don't know <laughs> Uh, so I just pulled up to the spot uh, Whenever I got off the phone with the dude that was taking my order Whenever I just uh, ordered this biryani You know what I'm saying He like said something at the end of it Like I placed my order with my man and everything like that But I just didn't understand what he could have said at the back Or like at the end of the conversation So it's like, you know what I'm saying There's nothing nothing that I could do if bro just rung me up for a $200 order right there And uh, I only wanted the one plate So we gonna see I'm gonna grab what I need And uh we're gonna see what this is talking about over here. Just with the charcoal toothpaste, just what I needed. Now we're about to hit this cuisine spot right here. Um, it's right next to actually the Mumbai market down this spot right there. That's like an Indian rest or an Indian shop where they got like you know groceries and stuff. But this is the spot. They must be in cahoots or something like that. So we're gonna see what's in here. You know, I got a couple of my gentlemen in here. Let's see what it's talking about. Hey, how you doing, man? Uh, yeah, that's right. I ain't never had, she got the button on here. I ain't never had no biryani before. It's good? It's good here? Yeah. Nice. So you're here for lunch? Right? So, see, I came from the right place. I seen a bunch of reviews that was on there saying that it was good and stuff. So we're going to see. We're going to see. Right around the way. I ain't, I ain't been here yet. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thank you. Let's see what he's talking about here. And you can see on the door right here, it says halal. Let me see. Everything halal in the spot. So, all right. I'm about to slide back to the crib. We're going to try this out. You know what I'm saying? Actually, it might be nice enough outside just to try it right here, but we're going to see. All right, what's up, y'all? We just got back to the crib with the chicken biryani with the uh, butter naan. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to tear into this, see what it's talking about. Uh, you know, the guy that or that gave me the food, you know, what is this right here? Okay, I'm just not opening it up. This looks like some ranch. I'm not really, I don't really get down with ranch. Uh, so I'm going to put that to the side. I'm not sure if that's what that is or not. Uh, let me see. The guy that ordered, uh, that, you know, took my order and checked me out, you know, he had the button down polo both buttons sweat on the shirt everything like that he's telling me this he's telling me a hit though so we're gonna see you know what i'm saying uh it seemed like you know by the uh clientele that was in there or not you know let me see so we got the styrofoam box it's heavy uh you know we got the nan in the tin foil right here so this right here goes for 20 20 dollars 20 dollars for this one let me get the first got the out the way right here and the one thing that I forgot in the spot over there, bro, one thing that I forgot to get over there was some napkins. Oh, shit, that's looking official. I didn't get no napkins with it, but that's fine. I got some over here. So we got the lemon, lemon matching with the yellow rice. Damn, with the chicken all underneath it. I'm not sure if it's bone-in chicken. It's probably like chicken thighs or something underneath. But we got the onions all in that. We got the, I don't know if that's cilantro. Damn. It smells good though. It's, it was pungent in my car whenever I was going ahead and driving home with it. I could already smell it through the bag. I'm gonna hit it with the lime right here. You guys can see. Let's see. I'm gonna try some of this butter naan. This is my first time trying some type of Indian food, so we're gonna see. Guy at the counters talking about it. You came to the right spot. I didn't even ask him. I meant to ask him if that was a. Um, you know what I'm saying? I meant to ask him if it was the same owners for that Indian market that was right across the street. Or you know right down the way in that spot but yeah i came home to try this out right here because you know it's daylight savings yesterday it was dark as hell so i'm not even about to try to mess with my phone out there so there you go i'm gonna try to get a piece of chicken in there too let me see 
Nah, we got this. Okay, I think it is a, like a leg or something. So here's the rice. There go the rice. And I ordered this a level hotter than the mild, which is the lowest level of hotness in there. So, and it's still already first bite. Damn, it's it's, it's flavorful, but it's it's like you can feel the heat all right away. Had a piece of chicken in that bite. Let's see what it's talking about. You got the chicken leg in there. Mmm. Oh, shit. Real tender. Like three grains of rice just fell out of the box, but that's straight. I'm about to pick that up. Mmm. With the onion. Oh yeah, this hit. This hit for sure. That gets like a, that gets like a like a nine for me. What else can make it better? I don't know what's. The, I gotta dig in there and see if that's a thigh underneath the, all this rice. But that that leg. That's hitting. Falling off the bone. Rice is super flavorful. You know what I'm saying? All right, I'm about to try this butter naan, this butter naan real quick. Hold up. All right, so here go the butter naan right here. You feel me? They got it all nice and charred right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and, you know, I'm gonna try it by itself and then I'm gonna try it with some of this rice and chicken right here. Yeah, it's fire. It's good, it's good pita bread. Or a good, good naan, you know what I'm saying? All right, I'm about to try some of that with. This is how they, this is how they do it in like, you know, I've been seeing people with these videos picking up these. We're gonna see. A piece of chicken in there too. Mm-hmm. Banging. This torch right here. I'll definitely go back to that spot right there. If you ain't never had no chicken biryani, I definitely recommend you go try some. Alright, man, that's it for this one. Definitely try some Indian food. We'll see you on the next one. Peace. Yo, I know I ended the video, but I just had to jump back on here and say, damn, man, this is some fire. I'm like sweating. I'm like sweating like I'm eating hot wings over here. Like I'm dead ass sweating and my upper lip and stuff like that. But it's, this is just, I got to tell everybody, you got to get some of this. If you got an Indian place over here, you got, of course, check the reviews first, but definitely get you some chicken biryani. This is some torch. And I'm going to have some left over here. So, all right. Peace to the next one.